YouTube! If you guys keep supporting this downfall content like you have been with the crazy amount of views and the crazy amount of engagement, I'm just gonna have to keep making it for you. We got the Hexaghost today. And when I went into playing this character, everyone was telling me that this is the most likely character for me to rage and, and, and give up on because he's too complicated. And I mean, given the fact that nine months ago when I played that downfall the last time, this was the character that made me officially rage quit and not want to play it anymore. They've done a lot of work and the character is still very complicated, but refined enough that once you get a hold of what you're doing, he feels like he kind of flows really, really well, similar to the defect. Really, really complicated up front, but then once you understand it, it kind of makes sense. Hope you enjoy the content. If you do, continue to support it. As soon as you guys don't support it and this gets inevitably less views than the, the other downfall videos, again, I'm going to cry. So, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you tomorrow. Mwah. So I've got four more bosses that I haven't even unlocked. We're playing as the Hexaghost. All right. The first time you ignite a ghost flame each turn, gain four block. Ignite. 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 Hello, heart. This is available only on PC. Yeah, because it's only on Steam. All right. We're fighting the Watcher. Ew. As our first boss, we have to fight the fucking Watcher? That's a tough first boss, man. Mr. Frost, you are so awesome. Thank you're you. the only YouTuber my girlfriend likes because she thinks you're funny, so we watch your content all the time. Love Thanks to hear for it. the awesome content, less than three. I love to hear that. All right, you start out with your cards. You got your four strikes, four defense. Uh, Seer, it's ethereal, and it's afterlife. If this card is exhausted, its effects activate. So you want to let this card exhaust? Apply 10 soul burn. After three turns, a soul burn character, a soul burn enemy loses HP, removing the soul burn effect. After three turns, three turns. Uh, and then this is advance. Move to the move the next ghost flame, moving onto a wait. Move the next ghost flame, moving onto a ghost flame extinguishes it. And then you can retract or advance with float plus. And then you also have kindle, which. If the current ghost flame is not ignited, ignite it. And then it, now it's just ignite the current ghost flame. Okay. So we should upgrade one of these. And I don't know which one is the best to upgrade. I know that this is gain block whenever I ignite a ghost flame. I mean, retract or advance? Advance slash retract becomes obvious as soon as you finish your first combat. Mm, okay. Retract is advance backwards. Yeah, but I don't even know what advance means. So. <laughs> like, I got to play the game in order to figure out what these means. But I like zero cost things being upgraded, so I'm gonna upgrade float. All right, let's take a combat. Hex Ghost channels powers by charging its flames. Perform a certain action while each flame is active to charge it. Ignite when one attack is played. Ignition, apply four soul burn to a random enemy. At the end of your turn, if this is, ignite, ignite, is ignited, advance to the next ghost flame. Still don't understand. When two attacks are played, ignites when two attacks are played. And then the ignition will apply four soul burn to a random enemy. And then if it's ignited, it it advances. You can choose to do nothing. I would like to advance. Ignites when two skills are played. Deals three damage to a random enemy twice. At the end of your turn, if this is ignited, move to the next ghost flame. So I got to learn what every single ghost flame does. When a power is played, gain four block and one strength. This is so, this is so annoying. I'm annoyed already. I am annoyed. So this should proc this turn. In one turn, it loses 10 HP. That should be this turn though, because this is the third turn. Make an advance. Okay, I was right. I was right. Heart. 
Thank you for the 333 wit. Thank you. I'll, I'll, I'll ignite all over you. Deal eight damage if the current ghost flame is ignited. Ignite it again. Okay. I like a little of that. Deal four damage twice. Reclaim. Put a card from your exhaust pile into your discard pile. A random afterlife card. Ethereal. Deal 10 damage. When exhausted, gain a shadow strike. It reclaims the nightmare strike. You're going to play more Soulbird and the counter doesn't restart. Yeah, yeah. That's what I was testing there. I kind of like a haunting echo. Because the first time that you ignite a ghost flame, you get four blocks. So more ignition is good. Early on, it feels like. Yeah. I feel like more ignition early could be good. I'm taking a lot of damage. Why did I get five block? What did I do? Did I play a defend? Yes. When one attack is played, apply four soul burn to a random enemy. Don't care, didn't ask. Would like to advance. Two skills. Bang. And then we can ignite again. Yo, 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 yo. This is how working. Is it going? I two hated how that time. sounded. <laughs> what up, Wogert? Thank you for the two months, man. I'm understanding. Okay. Okay. I'm understanding. Ignite the two previous ghost flame. The, wait, the, ignite the previous ghost flame two times. Rewind. It's rewind time? Deal eight damage to all enemies. I, I mean, a little AOE is not bad. I'm going to take more ignition right now. I, I, I like the effect. I'm starting to learn. Okay. Let us sear you. Let us ignite you. Let us ignite you. Alright, 18 soul burn in two turns. Okay. Times five, we can block that easily. And then this is the two skills, so we need to double skill it. Skill it! I'm gonna do this. And then I'm gonna uh, do one of these. And then we don't have any powers in the deck, so we don't want to go to the third one that was the power, right? So we want to retract here, I think. Back to the last one. Maybe we should have retracted first more than I see it. Yeah, we should have retracted first. Okay. Made it. This is two skills. What? I used two skills. Oh. It took my soul. No, I'm on the previous one. Wait, but this one's ignited. Afterlife cards play when they get exhausted. So using energy on Seer is a bit of a waste. But if I wanted to play multiple times, it's not a waste. Bitch. What does this do when I'm at the first one? Okay. That makes sense. That makes sense. That makes sense. That makes sense. I think. I think. Doesn't, actually. I lied. I lied. I lied, man. It makes no fucking sense. Um, ignite the current ghost flame and then extinguish it. We need block stuff, man. We're just not finding block cards. Hope you're having fun so far. What the hell I is vigor? First so this is like like the hexaghost is just all set up. He's just he's just I do nothing on this turn. But I do stuff later. I just I just do stuff later. I'm skipping these. I don't like these. Is that is that good? I, I don't know. I just feel like we're not finding anything defensive right now. And defensive stuff seems good when you don't have defensive stuff. You want block or powers or afterlife, right? Like, I feel like I'm not seeing much stuff at the moment. And I need to see more things. Ghost Slash is free damage. It's free damage that takes up a draw spot for a non-defensive card. Because by that logic, I should just take any card that says damage and afterlife because then it's free damage. But it's not free damage because I have to take up a draw slot in my hand that could be block cards and I die. Yeah, I think this is skip. I'm going with my gut here and it says skip. Sacrifice. Sacrifice. Power. Whenever you advance, gain two temporary strength. Speed running. <laughs> kind of fun. That's kind of cool. Um, Retract. Lose five HP. Gain one intangible. Ooh. Ooh. 
Okay, so 5 HP to take no HP, to take no damage. That's pretty good. Lose 3 HP. Mm. Mm. Okay. If the current ghost flame is not ignited, gain 1 energy and gain 12 block. That's a good block card. Maybe. Deal 9 damage. After soul burn detonates on an enemy, apply 12 soul burn. Just gonna remember? Seems like these two are decent cards to take. All right, I'm going with my gut. I'm gutting it. I'm going with my gut, chat. Don't stop me from going with my gut. Oh my god. Uh, draw a card. My soul burn detonates in advance, so that we can play two spells. Boom. Sweet. Now we take zero damage, and then we slap him. You see what I did there? Uh, currently not ignited. Gain 12 block and one energy. It doesn't do anything. Um, ignite the previous ghost flame two times. Sick. If the current ghost flame is not ignited, ignite it. It is now ignited, which gains one, gain one strength. Okay. And then if the current ghost flame is ignited, ignite it again. Another strength. What is the conversion of bits to money? 100 bits is exactly a dollar in my pocket. You just pay the fee up front. So I have eight strength, so I can just boom. What is this one? He was going to soul burn him? Shit, dude. I'm fucking shit up right now. Could take another in corporal. We are advancing a little bit. So like speed running doesn't seem like it's awful, but it also seems awful. Exhaust a card. If it was an attack or a skill, gain a random card of the opposite type. Oh, I get it. I get it. I get it. I get it. So if I if I get rid of a skill, it gives me an attack. If I get rid of an attack, it gives me a skill. What's the upgrade of this? It costs one less. That doesn't sound terrible. I, I also just kind of want to take double in corporal. <laughs> Is there any good way for this character to heal? Because I kind of just want to like drop as many in corporals as possible. Incorporeal, sorry. No, there's not a good way to heal. There's a power that heals you. The first seal power. I don't really like the speed running. Like, it doesn't seem like it's that good. Am I right? Hexaghost Enjoyers, am I right that speed running is not that good of a card? Like, if it upgraded to, like, four strength every single time, that'd be cool. But just, like, two temp strength seems ass. Only good in decks that advance a lot in a single turn. True. Worthy seems cool. I just don't know if it's good. You know? It just seems kind of ass. I don't like RNG cards. All right, we could upgrade this. We could upgrade this. It's 11 damage. Whoa, 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 whoa. It's ketchup plus. I love me some... I don't like ketchup IRL, but I love some ketchup in this game. But I think, I think ketchup plus seems great. I'm going to upgrade that. See what we get here. Centennial puzzle's great. Do I want to get double upgrade or do I want to go to another campfire is the question. Or do I want to get double upgrade here or do I want to go to double elite? Do I even think that I can take elites? I don't know. <laughs> I, I don't even know if I can take three combats, five combats. No, I'm kind of fucks you right now. Okay, Maybe. if you win, give 10 gifted deal. Sure. I'm going to upgrade the Kindle. Yo, dude. Sup? Take one of these. And then one of these. I like how it like travels up. It's kind of cute. Uh, shield me. I think this is probably a good incor incorporeal. Because it works with also Centennial 22. Puzzle. And then... Now we can do this. Cool. 
Now we want to own you this turn. This turn owning you is pretty cool. And we need to do it off of... Ignites? Wait. Which one? Is the purple one the one that I'm on? The purple one is the one that I'm on, right? Okay. Purple is the one that I'm on. Dude, I'm owning. Actually kind of owning. Soul burned. Your soul has been burned. Deal four damage if the enemy has soul burn detonated. <gasps> no. <gasps> Why? Phantom Fireball is good if I'm if I'm applying a lot of soul burn, which sometimes I am. Hey Gremlin Amba, I was told that I was gonna get fucked by you. Let's see that. Um We can advance. Right? We can advance, which would then get us to this one. And then we could then apply a billion soul burn. Good, right? Three damage to an enemy twice. It's 18. Wait, isn't this just... Wait, hold on. Isn't... Isn't crushing ghost flame just better? That's six damage tw three times. That's 18 damage. Versus the soul burn. Which is four soul burn three times. That's just 12 damage. Like, we have soul burn, don't get me wrong, but, like, it just feels like the numbers are just better. But you get soul burn synergy? What? With, like, detonating it? It's still just 12 damage. It's either deal 12 damage or it's... Because I, I want to know what I'm going to draw first. Because if we draw catch up this turn, it's really bad. I think. Let's advance. Didn't draw catch up. When two skills are played, you'll deal three damage twice, and it'll ignite, which will move to this one, which is a power, but we don't have any powers, but then we can catch up to deal 18 damage, so it's better. It's only six damage this turn, but then it's catch up. And we, yeah, see, catch up's really, really good here, and you can also fire ball. I think we're probably going to dab this one here. You could draw a bunch of cards. Do I want to do that? Maybe that's better. I don't feel like it is. I feel like drawing a billion cards next turn is better. Because we currently don't have this ignited. So if we draw extra cards next turn. Yeah, if we draw extra cards next turn, then we have the chance to draw Kindle. We didn't draw. It sucks. Let's do this. Okay. We could have ignited the soul burn here, but I think we'll be fine to deal the the, the damage here, or we'll try incorporeal. We didn't draw either of them. This is bad. Um, do we have lethal though? Because if we go back, we can, if we, if we retract, we can deal six damage, six damage plus six. So we need to draw anything we draw is lethal. Oh yeah. We just, we just have lethal or we go intangible. It's either intangible or lethal it is intangible. Wait, does that... Ret oh, that retracts as well. I forgot that that retracts as well. It's fine. We still have lethal next turn. I forgot that that retracts as well. <laughs> Bottled lightning. Devil's dance. The first time you retract each turn, gain one energy and draw a card. That seems sick. Radiant flame looks so cool. Maybe you ignite a ghost flame, gain three block. We do ignite sometimes. Wait, that's nine block with uh, catch a plus, right? And also block with this guy. Wait, that's actually sick. Or it deals six damage to a random enemy. Repeat for each exhausted ethereal card. That's shit. 
Yeah, I think Radiant Flame seems pogged up. And then let's bottle the lightning. Probably incorporeal. It's probably incorporeal because it allows us to have a good turn one sometimes. But no, but it'll be bad against like... Hello, less than three. But incorporeal because it draws with Centennial Puzzle. We just need to get an upgrade on it. You don't want to retract first though. It's true. You don't want to retract first though. Maybe it's just float. Yeah, because floats draw neutral. Yeah, I like float plus. Okay, just making sure I do everything. Hmm. Um, depends on what we draw here, whether or not we would like to. No, kind of. Shield of the night. We could do nothing. <laughs> do nothing. Would you like to do nothing? I love that the damage can be spread. I don't know which if I would prefer the other way. I don't know. Ignite the current ghost flame. Plus one strength. Hi. Yo. And then this one is two attacks and we get more soul burn. So it goes through all of them twice. And then you blast them. Then you blast them. Got a blast. This is gross, right? That was sick. That was gross. And I ignited this one, so now we advance. Okay. Whenever two skills are played. We do this, so he gains a billion ghost flame. And then we sear for more ghost flame, which ignites here. So now we're actually here, which is whenever you spend three energy, but it doesn't matter because now we hit a phantom fireball that would have done eight plus 26 damage. Another radiant flame. Poggers. Uh, definitely want to advance here. I think that flame do be radiant. Yeah, a little bit. Okay, so you definitely do this. Then you advance. And then you hit one of these. And then you hit one of these. One billion soul burn and block. Okay. Double radiant here. What are we on? Whenever you play a power. Wait, it actually worked with the power too. I got the double buff. Wait, no, I didn't. Because it was four plus four plus three. No, it wasn't. Never mind. And now... Ignite the current ghost flame. Boom! Shield of the night. What is this one? This one's... Wait. This one's double attack. We do have double attack here. I want to know if this works here. Hold on. I know we should play this first. So if I double attack, does the haunting echo go off? It did. Boom. Gain seven block for each ignited ghost flame. Upgrade a random card in your hand. <laughs> Gain eight block and advance. Yeah, Stoke seems good. Advance also seems good. They both seem good. Cards that make advance make Inferno ghost flame more accessible. Yeah. Right? And then there's also upgrading your cards. But like, are our upgrades really that good? Is the question. Right now, the cards that we don't have upgrade, upgraded, like, don't get me wrong, you want those upgraded, but like the other upgrades, eh, it just doesn't, it doesn't seem like the other upgrades are like all that good. <laughs> hey, what up, British fries? I don't know. I don't know why I'm scrolling up. It's just the natural thing to do. Thank you for the brand new Prime, bro. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Much love in the chat, please. Yeah, I'm gonna take an advancing guard. I'm going to my gut here. Lose 11 max HP, gain sharpened fragment. 
At the end of each turn, gain a Crystal Shiv. A crystal Shiver is zero attack cards with which exhausts. Wait, that would help me so much with igniting some flames. Or you gain a broken wing statue. The cultists that worship the awakened one will be interested in this. Wait, so if I give this to them, what the hell does this even mean? I like the broken wing statue. There's an event later that takes it. Plus the cultist just flees instead of you having it. If you have it. Wait, really? Any cultist that you find? They just run away. That's dope. What does the uh, event later do? I, I, am, I am allowing the spoiler here. You get a 20 damage sacrificial dagger. Like a sacrificial dagger that I can scale. I'm gonna take I'm gonna take this. I'm actually gonna take the crystal shivs. I like it because of the early advancing of this, you know? Uh we can advance and then catch up. Omega Soul Burn. And then Actually, we probably don't even want to do this because I'm okay with this, right? I'm actually okay with this. Yeah. So, you can skill. Oh, they travel between turns. You can do nothing with float? Yeah, but I had zero energy, so I would have drawn a dead card. Don't want to do that, my friendo. Mm -mm -mm. Ethereal seal. If six seals have been played this combat, obtain the broken seal and remove the seals from your deck. The end of the combat, gain an additional potion reward. Seals are bait? Or are they claws? Uh, gain seven block. When exhausted, gain one blur. Ooh, that's kind of fun. Wait, ghost shield's kind of cool. Ignite the current ghost flame and advance. I like a little fast forward. Fast forward's cracked, IMO. Yeah, it seems kind of cracked. Let's go fast forward here. I'm kind of digging the advanced stuff, so I, it, it, appear, it appeals to me for sure. Okay. Um... I think you want to advance first and then start dropping spells, right? Right? Wait, hold on. Wait, hold on. There's a big brain play here. I wonder if I can do it. Let me see if my brain can handle this. Okay. Now we're on the one that ignites when you play two spells. If we had one more mana, that'd be sick, but we don't, and that's lame. Boom, 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 boom. Uh, catch up. Love a catch up here. Don't have a power to play right now. Just gonna kill that guy real quick. Why does Frost call skills spells? Because they're spells. Ignite the current ghost flame in advance. Ignite the current ghost flame. Hagbar, thank you for the brand new one. Gain block equal to soul burn on all enemies, then remove the soul burn. It doesn't burn it, right? It's not... It's not igniting the burn. Yeah, it's not detonating. That's the keyword. Now we could take a stoke, though. We could we could transition to a stoke there. You could take a stoke now. It's fine. We'll take a stoke. I'll try it. All right. Hello, Watcher. For the boss fights, I have to move my camera so you guys can see all of their intents. What are you doing? You're going to be dealing nine damage, gaining a billion block. And it, why do you have... What, these guys always take so many curses, man. It's so cringe. <laughs> um, We do have the availability to ignite this one. So we can ignite this guy and then we can advance. Let's ignite. Thank you, Crystal Shiv. Then let's advance. Sick. Because then you can do this. 
Advancing again. Now we're double advanced. 17 block. Okay. He's got cloak class. Oh, no. All right. Now you want a radiant flame here. It's going to give you four block. Now you can stoke the fire. Hey, upgrading fucking everything. Everything's fucking upgraded now. Ignite. S slap him. Talk, talking to me? Talking to me right now? You're playing fasting? Oh, but you're playing a panacea first. Good shit. I mean, honestly, decent combo. Uh, two attacks. Easy to play. Haunting Echo. Reignite. Soul burning. You're burn your soul is currently burning. Cloak clasped. Okay, now we're on double skillage. Ignite the current coast flame in advance. And now we just got to do one of these. Um, let's then immediately catch up real quick. That seemed like a decent turn. I'm not exactly sure what happened though. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not entirely sure. What the fuck just happened? But something happened. You're in the you're in wrath now. Wait, what that means? I, does that mean I deal double damage? Why am I not dealing double damage? Huh? Read her right. At the end of her turn, if Watcher is at her for low fifty percent, she answers wrath. Watcher's wrath increases her damage up by fifty percent instead of received instead of hundred percent. That's lame and stupid, and I don't like it. I want to draw a card. It's a strike. So we actually do nothing here. So we activate our flame. We flame on. We still haven't taken damage here, so Incorporeal would have drawn us three cards. 27 incoming damage. We play two skills here. We will activate this. And then advance. And now we've advanced. Okay. Dealing zero damage to me. How are you gaining 20 block off of that? Uh, definitely want to kindle. You definitely like kindle. Or you could fast forward. Yeah, fast forwarding is fine as well. You do one of these. And then you do one of these. So then when you do this, upgrades a billion. You gain a billion block. Block, man. So much block. Okay, now we're currently here. Let's phantom the fire for sure. Because we want to play two skills. This is a two skill. Okay. Um, we can catch up and double skillage. No, we don't want to catch up because we needed to catch up before. But catch up gives us a bunch of blocks, so like it's whatever. Um, but if we double skill it, which means we're going to play incorporeal. No, because you can use ketchup. It's already ignited. That is true. It is already ignited. So I guess we don't need to. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um... Forty-six block. And then next turn, we've got you with a hexa slam, which is 24 damage. Let's draw, do nothing, and then just fucking ignite it. I, that was the, I didn't like that noise. <laughs> I didn't, I didn't like that noise, man. Okay, we got sixth seal or fifth seal. Wait, at the end of combat, upgrade a random card in your deck? You're telling me that... You're telling me that seals aren't good? And then in each combat, gain an additional non-sixth seal seal card. Non-sixth seal 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 card. So this is to assemble Exodia? At the end of each... Wait, wait, you just gain an additional card reward? What the fuck? But you would just gain... Like, how many times are you just going to gain the same seal card over and over and over again? Or does it guarantee that it's only going to give you one of each? That's so lame. I think I would rather just take fifth seal. I think I, think I would rather just take fifth seal and get an upgrade. Yeah, no, I'm taking fifth seal, dude. And then we just take a runic pyramid because runic pyramids pog the fuck up. 
Yeah. Pog the fuck up. You are needed in the city. God damn it in all caps. Maybe if I got like 75 gifted subs, I would have clicked on it, but I got one dollar, you know? It's, it's not enough to convince me, right? I'm a I'm a I'm a I'm a slut for taking the cards that you want, but I'm not a cheap slut, you know? It just is what it is. I'm not I'm not a cheap slut, chat. So yeah, you just play this at the end of combat. Let's do that. Is there any reason not to sip the fruit juice? Yeah, because events that remove your max HP do it based on your max HP. Or remove HP in general deal based on your max HP. So don't drink fruit juice until you need to. Usually. Alright, we need to recall soon. An old beggar cloaked in fur reaches his hand out toward you. Spare some coin, child. Gain a hundred souls if you punch him in the face. Or you can just remove a card. I, I like the idea of removing Seer. It's so it's so shit. It's so shit. I'm gonna remove one strike. Punch him in the face. You'd like that, wouldn't you? You'd freaking like that, wouldn't you, dude? Um, I could take the Burning Elite on this act. I'm feeling pretty strong. Could also go hella combats here. Boo, boo. Hit him with one of these. Hit him with one of those. Advance me. I think it might be incorporeal. Here. Right. Yeah. Sweet. That was fun. I liked doing that. That was really fun. <laughs> I had a lot of fun doing that. Okay. Um. Could just ignite here. Well, wait. Hold on. I want to see if this works. If I play this, and then I. Okay, this does work. And then this is double attack, so that means we can do this. Wait, no, this is the power one. Wait, what? Am I drunk? Oh, because the last one did advance. I'm learning. I'm learning. You gotta learn. You gotta you gotta learn in order to learn. You know what I'm saying? Uh let's ignite. The crystal shivs are less good now, but they're still pretty good. Hit him with one of these. Hit him with one of these. Ignited. Uh, gain seven, gain eight block in advance. And then stoke, which is going to ignite. It didn't ignite. That's stupid. Incorporeal is now permanently upgraded. Now we can drink because I'll take another potion. I will assemble Exodia all by myself. My father's deck has no bad cards. Grandfather's? I'm not. Do I look like I'm Yugi to me? Do I, do I look like I'm Yugi? No, I'm not. I give birth to Yugi. Watch the anime. All right, that's fair. <laughs> Lose 33 max HP. Unlock study and learn options. What the fuck? Click on it, Mr. Streamer. I don't know what the fuck this does could get you apparitions there are apparitions from these guys on the normal runs yeah yeah no i realize that the council of ghosts is normally apparitions read the lines below wait oh lose all strikes gain three council justices deal six damage increased by three for each exhausted apparition wait so we get both of them or do we only get one of them i love three apparitions with losing all my defense that's fine actually you get both that's actually so fine. That's actually like, like, I, I don't even, I can't even tell you how fine these are. That we get our strikes out of our deck and we get these You're instead of these because we have, this is so good. Fourth rate deck. That's actually so pogged up. 
I, I don't like. I don't even think this is like a risky thing. Shut up, Kale. I didn't actually watch a Yu-Gi-Oh, so I don't know a lot of the memes that you're saying. Yo, Jeering Goose, thank you so much, man. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you very much for the brand new tier one. I don't know why I didn't watch Yu-Gi-Oh as a kid. I just didn't. It just never happened. It just didn't happen all that much. I'm going to ignite you. No, we want to play this first. And we ignite you three times. Now we can... We could advance. Doesn't really do much, though. We can stoke. I'm done with stoking. Let's get that ship. Wait, you kill the shopkeeper? Yeah, the shopkeeper's evil in this. Kind of a dick, to be honest. Dude, this is actually, like, fucking OP. I'm just going to say this right now. Like, I I'm just going to say it right now. The, the the apparition shit is actually just OP. Yugi when he goes PH, I'd kind Dude, we can also apparition incorporeal. Wait a second. This is just gross. Advance me. Kindle me. See it. Upgraded my Radiant Flames. Wait, are we the baddies? Uh, yeah, we are currently the, um, the bosses doing the hard spinning. Strike from beyond apparitions, right? Strike from beyond for apparitions? Wait, no, it has to have afterlife on it. Never mind, it's afterlife. Ethereal gained nine block. When exhausted, gain a shadow guise. Guys? That's, that's cringe. Yo, what up, heart? membership card i can't take you i need so much more of my money right now in order to recall yeah i, I need my money right now to recall so that i can fight this stuff i don't think we can take membi dude I, I i actually don't think you take membi here you can recall later no i understand but i need the money to be able to recall you get so many souls after you kill the shop bro i'm not anywhere fucking close to killing the shop huh i'm not anywhere close to killing the shopkeeper how much health did he have at the end I'm not fucking killing the shopkeeper. I kind of like another ketchup, to be honest. If there's anything I want to buy, it's just another ketchup. No, I'm not taking these. I'm, I'm going to take another ketchup. That's it. I'm only taking ketchup. And then we're recalling here because I need to start smashing keys. Omomori? No, I'm smashing this. I'm smashing an Omomori. Yo, what's up? I think I'm just going to use this on you guys. Uh, Ignite the current flame and advance. And then draw me. Advance. So then now we're here. So we gain block. Sick. And now we can gain do you as well. We can do you. Okay. Okay. Now we have apparition for you guys. That's sick. Um, I would like to ignite the previous ghost frame three times. Pretty good. Let's ignite this one now. I don't think I kill all of these guys right now. Next turn, we need a fifth seal. Do I get Hexagos better? Yeah, I'm learning. I think I'm learning super fast. How fast would you think I'm learning, Chad? How fast would you say I'm learning? Yeah, we can do this. And then we can actually incorporeal. Because we'll only use three. And then we gain seven back. All right. Then we'll hit one of these. Then we'll hit one of these. And then ignite this previous ghost flame so we gain a billion strength. Currently have plus six strength. Not the best one, not bad though. In one energy and draw a card for each ignited flame, then extinguish them. Ooh. Ooh. I didn't mean to click on it like that. I wanted to look at the upgrade. I now have a blight ritual, a bright ritual in my hand. 
or in my deck. I wanted to I wanted to look at the upgrade. I meant to right click. Oops. Oops, oops, oops. Alright, let's do you. You. Sick. Um let's float it. Let's advance you. So now we're here. This spell will ignite you twice. But then we need one more skill. So we could incorporeal, but I don't think we need to this turn because this travels between turns, we've realized. So now I can uh, do one of these, which will then do that, which now we can advance. You advancing guard. And then you hit one of these. And then... And then... Pause, champ. Next turn, we're going to be on this one, which is two attacks will ignite you. We've got boom to ignite. And then we've got crystal shiv ignited. So then we can stoke the fire. Thank you for subscribing. Upgrades a billion and a half cards. We've got crystal shiv. We can also do this, though. Kill you. Guarantee some soul burn on you. Hit him with the justice. Frost skipped membership card. Very sad. I took the correct stuff. Let it be known. Let it be known that I took the correct stuff every single of the time. Um. Ignite the current flame and fast forward. And then ignite the current flame. Boom. I said boom, motherfucker. Do, boo, do. Play this to get it out of hand. Wait, we stick here now. Do I like that we stick here? I don't really care that we stick here. This. Do this. Let's hit with one of these. Because this turn he's going to get ignited for a bunch. Now we can do this. 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 Got a power potion. Blur could be good. Blur could be good now that we have Runic Pyramid. Nah, never mind. I sleep. Do I want to go here and get my keys crushed? Do I want to crush some keys right now? Nah, let's go for the Burning Elite. Oh, obtain the book for 16 HP. You need to interpret the elaborate skips, script for eat for you know the power that lies within and the cost it will incur upon its owner. I'm new to this mod. Do we, we still don't say want this gremlin knob. Yeah. We very much don't want a Necronomicon. We skipped the Omomori and we have zero two cost attacks. <laughs> yeah, goodbye. Well, minus 16 HP, smiley face. Will that cost us? Um, power me. Long time YouTube viewer. Glad to finally catch some streams now that I no longer work night shifts. First time you retract each turn, gain one energy. To intensify? Intensity increases the amount of damage soul burn and block applies by the ghost flames when ignited. I don't know if this works on my passive. It does not. Okay, that's fine. We're learning, we're learning, we're learning. Um, advance me and then ignite me and then catch up me and then weaken potion me not bad actually not bad um okay hit him with a radiant no we want to ignite and fast no we want to do that okay shut the fuck up chat shut the fuck up watch this watch me game watch Okay. Watch me game. Okay. You radiant flame. Boom! You fast forward. Boom! 
you b bright ritual. Which now will allow us to first seal. Boom. Then you apparition. Then you can incorporeal, which will then retract. Shiv. Um, what do we have in hand here? We don't have a whole lot of ignited flames at the moment, but that's not a big deal, to be honest. You can definitely make room in hand by doing something like this, and then ignite the flame. Okay. Shiv me. And then we're going to ignite the previous flame, which will be this guy. Then he gets more soul burn from that. Now we move on to this guy. We've got fifth seal here to ignite this flame. You fifth seal, 17 block, shiv. And then you can... Upgrade a billion cards. These are now 24 damage apiece. We attack you. And then we catch up. No, you don't need to catch up, actually. You just fucking killed this guy. He's about to take 44 damage, because when it's highlighted, it, it, it gets the damage that he's going to take. He's dead. Get our first seal upgrade to get a bag of preparation. Exhum an ethereal card. <gasps> you mean... My apparitions? You mean my... That means if apparitions get upgraded, they're less good. They're less good if they get upgraded by fifth seal, right? They're less good. Deal four damage whenever you advance or retract. Return this from the discard pile. So sixth seal could have gotten you a bunch of fifth seals. Yeah, but I've now just gotten a bunch of fifth seals myself. A pen! Okay. Hey, guys. Um, we've got a crystal shiv. We can also advance here. I think advancing here is probably good. Yeah, you want to advance. And then radiant flame into shield of the night. Apparition, which will now advance that. We're not getting weakened, so there's no reason to play crystal shiv here. When we could draw another power next turn and get plus one strength. You feel me, chat? Still not getting weakened. Fifth seal in hand. Do we like a fifth seal here? Is the question. Because we can just ignite it with this. You do this. Ignite the flame. And then it moves on, which then you ignite the previous flame three times. Plus four strength. Now that one's ignited, okay? Now that guy's ignited. Which means now we can hit you for 13, that's fine. Okay, not getting weakened still. We are getting vulnerable, but we got a bunch of apparitions still in the deck. Now we need to play two skills here. Um, We can ignite, so you ignite current flame. And then you stoke the fire. Wait, hold on. No. You want to attack here first. And then attack here first. And then... Boom! Phantom Balls! Double Apparition me. We've got justice coming in. Let's seal our fate. Yeah. 
Now let's seal again. Um, you're kind of useless and I don't care. Didn't ask. So let's advance past you. Ignite the current guy and then advance again. Slice him up. Exhume an ethereal card. No, we don't want to do that this turn. Can we just go back to licking people? <laughs> um, yes. Uh, exhume the ethereal card. Give me this guy. Slap you with that one. Let's save you for next turn. 52 damage on a... This is a strike, by the way. This is our strike card, chat. Let's do this one. And then let's ignite two times in the back to kill him so we can save our pendant. I like Upgrades one of our justices. Words, magic man. <laughs> Volcano visage. Whenever you ignite a ghost flame, apply four soul burn to all enemies. Don't care, didn't ask, to be honest. Second stoke to fire, second bright ritual. I don't mind the second bright ritual here. You know? I actually straight up don't mind a second bright ritual. This seems pogged the fuck up. Maybe, maybe with double ketchup, you're right. Maybe you've convinced me. A uh, shopkeeper. Volcano Visage. Hit him with one of these. Hit him with one of these. Okay, you're kind of right, Chad. I'll, I'll, I, I admit that I was wrong. Hit him with one of these. Advance me. I, I, my brain is expanding for this guy, though. I know he's difficult. I, I know that this guy's difficult. I know, I know that you guys are all looking at him right now, and you're like, what the fuck, man? What the fuck are you doing, Tristan? Tristan, what the hell are you doing, man? What is that? I get it. I, like, I, I actually... I'm, I'm right there with you, man. Honestly, I don't know. Uh, if we play one more skill, it'll trigger this guy. So if we play this guy, it'll do that and then advance and also gain blocks so we actually win here. Okay, sick. Now we're double. Now we're, now we're here so we can use one of these guys next turn. We've soul burned. We're burning your soul, dude. Your soul's getting lit the heck up, man. Get burned. Get get fucking burned, man. Okay. We can reignite the flame as well and then move on. Which adds more burn. Which then you do this. Which will add more burn. Which then burns the burn. You're down to 200 health. Okay. Okay. Next turn he leaves, right? Yeah, okay. So we just need to make sure to play this and this. We don't really care about dealing the most damage possible. We just want to make sure we get our good powers off. Heal back up to full HP of 33 Pog, as well as upgrade another Justice. Ignite the Inferno. Wait, that's the last one? This guy's Inferno, right? Ignite the current, then the Inferno Ghost Flames. I don't really like that. I actually don't give a shit about Instant Inferno. I, I like That's not where our damage is coming from. Don't care, didn't ask. You know? Straight up, don't care, didn't ask. A third Radiant Flame, though? I can't say no to a third Radiant Flame. I can't. <laughs> what the hell is this? 30 Soul Burn? What the hell is this? Two Strength and two Dex? Add two Burn Pluses into your job. Line. That's cool. <clears throat> keys? Yeah, we just need 300 gold for keys, and I think we'll be enough. I think we'll have enough from the boss. I care plus I ask plus smile about it plus stay glad plus W plus not basic plus skill up. plus touch Shut the fuck up. I'm gonna, I'm gonna pee my pants. Plus you rose up plus no hate plus I'm gonna pee my pants, dude. Stop. Plus you got a life plus okay smile plus cool beans plus not cringe plus nice job plus paste plus grammar good thumbs up plus your I'm gonna fucking pee my pants, dude. G plus have a good day. Thank you so much for telling me to have a good day. Um... Love this. Love an advance here. An advance into a do nothing. Into a stoke the fire. Into another radiant. Into a shiv. And then here you're sealing your face. Dude, we need to draw some cards actually. Holy shit. I don't I don't want to actually kill this guy. I don't want to kill this guy in one turn. I need to draw into my... This is bad that we deal too much damage. <laughs> Shit, man. Shit! <laughs> um... <laughs> uh, Kindle me? Okay. It's 
fine. You can apply Soul Burn as much as you want. Soul Burn's fine because we just need to draw one of these four cards. Okay, it's fine. Um, I just need to play cards that don't do anything here. And then just guarantee to draw it this turn. Just guarantee to draw it this turn. No nice. Uh Upgraded my nightmare vision. Okay. Haunted hand. Uh, draw three cards. All cards in your hand become ethereal. We do have the ability to upgrade or to draw more ethereal cards sometimes. Like it's... It's interesting, but I don't think I want it right now. You will lose your hand. You'll lose your hand, dude. This guy's going to feed me on turn one. Chat, which one of you guys is playing currently? Because, Jesus, this is some Twitch chat level garbage. Yeah, it's a possible infinite. That's what I'm saying. That's what I was thinking. Is it a possible infinite? You're understanding my brain now. I think we incorporeal here. Well, we need to fast forward first. Let's ignite. Let's draw first. Hold on. You know what? Let's advance and then retract because I kind of like to be here. I like that. Um, catch... No, I want to catch up bit plus next turn. What's the mushroom card? He uh, So the Ironclad puts out mushrooms in order to then use his Reaper on them so he gains more HP. See? Then he Reapers so he can heal more. I was hoping you would hit this guy like one fucking time. Rat. <laughs> Dickhead. Um. Thank you for subscribing. Oh, wow. How's a downfall, Punk Frost? Wow. It's the downfall, Scoop. We want to say float for next turn because I really don't care about that. Like at all. Okay. Oh, he's got Jesus, I'm I literally didn't even register the fact that he played a flame barrier as his card. Don't attack him. <laughs> Advance. Unless you want to fucking die. Okay. Send him with one of these. 
Let's hit him with a baleen of that shit. Need one more skill. Okay. No, he's got red skull activated. <gasps> shit. Wait, he's going to heal for so much and he's dealing 32. Holy fuck. Um, it's probably advanced then. You probably want to advance and guard and then catch up, right? Advance to this and then you can play this like three times and that's like a billion and a half block. You can also advance for free. Maybe I like that better. I do like that better because it probably can kill one of these guys now. Forty-six block is indeed enough. And we can hit him with one of these. And then you're dead. And then you're dead. So now he heals for nothing. Let's go! You heal for nothing! Take that bitch. And then you advance, which now we're on this, which is now this is ignite the current ghost flame. <laughs> and then you move forward, which is now here. I have pen nib coming up. I don't even need to play it. Oh, I'm gonna Spit seal me. Up. Oh, I'm going to catch up. Oh, I'm going to fucking catch up everywhere. Haunting Echo is now upgraded. This one's about to expire. Let's get rid of that. Poltergeist? What the hell is that? Whenever you play an afterlife card, deal nine damage to a random enemy. We don't really have a lot of afterlife stuff, so I'm not going to take that, but that's fun. Hey, look, it's Sixth Seal. <laughs> hey, look, man. You can take Sixth Seal, Tristan. Time Warp, though. I don't know how much I like Time Warp because of... I mean, like, oh, maybe I do. Maybe it's like better later in in fights. We don't advance and retract that often, actually. We 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 like we do, but we don't. And I don't like the fact. I don't know if it when we advance on a. I don't know if when we advance in between turns, if it's gonna get put back in my hand before I draw. And I'm already putting a crystal shiv in my hand, so it seems kind of shit. To have two cards and only being able to draw like three sometimes. Time warp's fine if you get a lot of strength. We do sometimes in some fights, but I mean, we also have a Volcano Visage that's kind of owning, so I'm just going to rely on that a little bit. Don't think I want a Sneko. I don't really. Xanatos Icy Cream. Icy Charm. Gain one energy at the start of your turn. Soulburn takes four turns to activate. Hmm. I actually don't mind that. I don't mind that, actually. I don't mind. Hey, listen, chat. I got icy cream because I'm Frost Prime, so... Listen, listen, listen. Yeah, I think this is fine. This is fine. <laughs> Intruders in the beyond. All right, I gotta pee. Hello, it's me. I'm back. So I think we're going this middle path. Oh, wait. We can do it all at this shop. That's true. I forgot we could do this here. Uh, one strength. One dex. Upgrade. <clears throat> uh volcano radiance float me advance me catch up me seal me Mm. 
Is time warp and float a 2x and in infinite? Time warp plus float? I don't know. Is it? <gasps> Apparition me? Okay. Um, catch up me? Thirty-eight damage me. I don't want to incorporeal because I don't want to go backwards. But look, dude, this guy's about to take seventy damage, very, very soon. Uh, we have radiant flameage. We have haunting echoage. have a strike am i gonna do another run after this if i have time i would like to 82 damage straight to the face seems good i didn't play second seal no it was terrible <laughs> oops dicks uh slap me fast forward me We don't want to ignite this one unless we have a bunch of block because it could just hit this guy, I think. But now we can kill this guy here. That's awesome. It's pogged up. And by kill, I mean uh, we didn't kill you, which is weird. So let's move advance into plus strength into this. Okay. Fifth seal! I got fifth seal! <laughs> uh, this, you're dead. Love that for me. Um, I gotta remember that I have four energy now, so there's a lot more that I can do. A lot more that I can do. Let's ignite the other guy twice. Sick. Shield of the Knight's pretty cool. And we can fifth seal, I believe. Sweet. Where can I get your merch? Don't have it available yet. Soon, though. Soon. I know I keep saying that every time someone asks. So stop asking. <laughs> I'm not actually saying that. You can ask as many times as you want. Don't ask. But also do. But also don't fucking ask. But also. Soon TM. Catch me. Feels like this character doesn't have a lot of draws, but his cards are quite strong by themselves. Am I correct in finding that? Like, this is a good draw, but that's like the one good draw card I feel like we found recently. Advance me. Had a work meeting and missed the last hour. Have bit Yo. Hey, thank you. How dare you miss my stream ever? And if you've ever missed my stream, fuck you, dude. Fuck you, man. I mean, we just go to next turn. <laughs> we just we just literally just go to next turn and then you're dead. What did you upgrade? I, I don't like that it just kind of appears randomly. Gain an additional potion reward with fourth seal plus. We are slowly but surely assembling the Exodia. Exodia is bad. You're bad, High Voltage. Ever thought of that? Nope. Oh, wait. I should have gone to the fight because I need 30 souls from this guy, don't I? There's a second fire, but I just need money. I guess I can go this way. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. Hit him with one of these. Hit him with one of these. Oh, I didn't advance first. Oops. <laughs> that one was on me. I did an oopsie. Chad, I did an oopsie. More like this mod is bad. I don't think this mod's bad. 
I think this mod's pretty damn good, man. Maybe with one of these. Now that you're ignited, let's ignite you again. Love to ignite you, chat. I'd love to ignite you. And then we advance. So that we can do this. And then... One of these. Let's drink a potion. Whoops, I didn't mean to, I meant to use the weak potion. This game's replayed in armor. I meant to use the weakness potion. Take four damage, it's fine. We've got a fifth seal. Let's do this. Let us ignite you. Okay. Um... We've literally drawn zero of our apparitions. It's kind of annoying. Kind of an annoying thing. Okay. Let us hit you with one of these. Honestly, Stoke the Fire's been kind of shit, man. It's been kind of ass. It's been kind of ass. Wait, we're on this one? Okay. Uh, we need to play our seals. I would like to heal, and then next turn, now that you have one HP, I now fourth seal it. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. What is this? Gain four block each time you play a card this turn. That's kind of fun. Dex potion, don't care. Gain block equal to all soul burn on all enemies, then remove soul burn. We've seen that, don't really... I mean, it's actually pretty good with... It's pretty good with the Volcano Visage, but also a lot of our damage comes from the the Soul Burn, and I don't want to... I don't want to get Not rid of that, you know? Any more skeptical. Okay. Bit of a useless thing here. Bit of a useless one. Not the funny number anymore, Judge. Thank you for the 23 months. You're not as cool. Radiant Flame. It just has such a cool art. Like, the fuck is that? Why do you just get to have such a cool art, man? Okay. Focus up, focus up, Tristan. Focus up. I like shielding. I like igniting and fast forwarding. I like floating. We do nothing here. And then we advance after we've hit it. Now we first seal to hit this one. We've already got... Dude, that's, that's three in one turn. Holy shit. And then you attack here. You attack there. Ignites that one. Which now we can catch up the previous one three times. Th plus five strength. Catch up it two more times. Boom. Hit him with one of these. Uh, Stoke me, please. Speed running seems like it would be kind of bad. Yeah, I've not been taking speed running. Um, we need spells. We currently have like no spells, so let's do one of you, one of you, one of you, you. Dude, what is with our apparitions only coming in the bottom of the deck? What the hell is that? Uh, let's hit this. Okay, we can do this. And then we... Uh, oh, this, we should have played this in this order, but it doesn't matter. We incorporably go backwards. Going backwards to go forwards. Hit him with one of these. Hit him with a fifth seal. Okay. Slap. Slap. The combo. Um, we are healing for seven. Let's get a fourth seal in there. Yep. Now we're here. We need spells again. Unless... Check this out. Check this out. You do this. Ignite the current flame. Fast forward. Catch up three times. Catch up another two times. 
Uh, and then you're gonna fucking boom. And then you're gonna float. And you're gonna advance. And then you're gonna advance. And then you're gonna hit him with one of these. And then you're gonna hit him with one of these. Bring back uh, uh, two of these. And then you ignite again. And we ignite. And then we do and we get some ketchup. No, not my no. Uh I'll take another fast forward. Entropic Bruce seems good. Okay. Alright, 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 alright. Crystal shiv me. Good. Advance me. Volcano visage me. Catch up me. One skill is played. I'm skilling. Oh, I'm skilling everywhere. Now the 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 the, the soul burn on these guys is fairly useless because they will kill themselves before it is ever useful. Seal me. Too many wounds is going to be dangerous, so we do need to keep track of that. It is good in this situation though, so that I can do like this. Pog me. There's a lot of different plays that we have here, and I just I just want to decide which one I want to do. Got to think with my big brain. I definitely think we're playing Bright Ritual at some point. Really? One HP? I want him I want him guaranteed dead to be honest. Um Fuck. It's such a good combo. Uh but we will not we will refrain from doing it. I didn't know the dagger was up there. Yeah, sorry. It's hard to show everything, man. Let's do this. Gain some strength. Do this, gain some strength. Do this, gain some strength. Do this, gain some strength. Plus six strength. Fucking... Hit him with one of these. Maybe I should have kept that shiv, actually. Might have been a good shiv to keep. Um. Okay, I like uh, advancing guard here. Into fast four. No, catch up. No. Yes. No. Into incor incorporatorial. Yeah. We're going to incorpor incorporatorial, which will then send us back. Which then we can catch up again. Uh, then you catch up again. And then you catch up again. Okay. Can we fifth seal and get the kill here? Is the question. I mean, it doesn't really matter because we just have apparition, so we like always are gonna be fine. Ooh, I petted him. That was a mistake. I don't know what I upgraded there. A second entropic brew seems great. I have a shovel now. A third fast forward. Lose seven HP, gain a first seal. Gain a second seal. Gain a third seal. We are, dude. We could get Exodia here. We could get Exodia here. You're missing the sixth seal. I am missing the sixth seal. But if I get an additional card reward. <laughs> if I get an additional card reward. I actually don't like it. I like the additional potions, but I'm not actually going to go for Exodia. All right. Break me the Sapphire. And then we'll dig. No Exodia. <laughs> no Exodia. Fast forward me.
One skill me. Float me. Do nothing. Me. Radiantly flame me. Echo. Kindle. Stab. Do nothing me? People G. You people G right now, chat? Uh, incorporatorial goes back. So then when we fifth seal, hits up. We got catch up for next turn, so we ignite, move forward. Okay. Now we're here. Now we're here. So now we catch up. Strength. 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 Fast forward. Balls. Two skills, two skills, two skills. Plus nine strength on my crystal shifts is pretty good, I think. Volcano. Skill. Flame. Flame. Shiv. No, not my other apparition. Choose one of three ethereal cards from any class to gain. It costs zero this turn. Gain two strength, two decks, and add two burn pluses. Cards and ghost flames apply two more soul burns. Ooh. <laughs> Deal five damage, ignite the previous, then the next ghost flame. Those are two actually pretty good. Forked flame seems gross. We're going to take a forked flame. Do I want to go dig? Or do I want to fight? Because fighting gets me more upgrades, man. Fighting is like digging, but cooler. <laughs> Did you say digging is not cool? All right. That's all I needed to hear was digging wasn't cool. I needed to confirm it. That my belief that digging also wasn't cool is not cool. Wait, this is such a weird fight. Cause you do, you have three fast forwards in our hand. <laughs> so draw one. Do nothing. Fast forward me. Fast forward me. Fast forward me. Catch up me. Ship. Tristan, you're just a Northern Lion copy because you say blank followed by me. My bad, how could I? How could I? Ignited. Copy me. <laughs> Seal it. Mm -mm. We move back one. And then we catch up one. And by catch up one, I mean catch up three. Detonate it. Reignite him. Back over here. Forked flame. Stoke. Shield. Ignited. Ignite. <laughs> true. That's so true. That's very true, yeah. Mm -mm 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 -mm. 
don't care plus didn't ask plus ignited. Uh, don't care about this. Fast forward. Seal me. Seal me. Fast forward's good. We've got ketchup for next turn. Ketchup's a lot of block, and you kind of want to save it, you know? Forked flame. Deal 34 damage. Holy shit. Ignite. Ignite it again. Ignite it again. I have 64 block, man. Um, catch up. Catch up. Attack. Attack. My radiant and bones are upgraded. I have panties. Dude, actually, Haunting Echo's not bad. Backtrack Smack. I love that card, actually. Do I want another Phantom Fireball? I almost want another Phantom Fireball, but I don't think I do. I think I, I think our deck works kind of how it is. Okay. Blue Candle Poggy. Frost could copy Northern Lion by shaving. Yeah, but what if I, like, I didn't do that, though, you know? Uh, do nothing. Because it'll attack that. I wanted to know if that would trigger him, but it doesn't trigger him. Not triggered. Don't care. Didn't ask. Don't care. Didn't ask. Plus not triggered. Oh, I should have played Haunting Echo there. What am I doing? Yeah, I think 108 might be pretty good here. 118. 118 poison. Decent. Maybe. I don't know. Hard to say, really. Good morning, Mr. Frost. Been missing live streams because work picked up. But I've just gotten it. a week off forced upon me because Flatmate became a close shave, contact. You have more to too real also something, something, five... <clears throat> five saffron thank you for the five months if you shaved your head you'd have more tattoo real estate that's true that's true all right i need to move chat it is me the hexaghost pending doom don't i mean we can actually play these wait curses don't even fucking matter to us oh god that's okay and i draw four dude you're screwed man you're done for, dude. You're done for. Done for, I say. Done for. Attack. Hit him with one of these. You're dead. What hero is this? This is the gun man. He's got a gun. <laughs> it's the guy with a gun. Are you scared yet? Damn, we should have kept our thing. Damn. Um. No, we have. Let's catch up. Thank you for subscribing. Yo, what up? 
I, I don't like I'm not even paying attention to all of the things that he does. I, I That's what I think of it, you know? My doom. Not my doom. I just have to spend three energy here. Twenty-four freebies, man. Aside, dude. There's so much doom in my discard pile. Yeah. All right, let's uh, let's do one of these, one of these, and then we fast forward, and then we fork your flame, and then stoke me. Okay. And then, honestly, I'm just gonna nightmare here so that I can get that off, so that I can advance next turn. Kindle me. Hit me with one of these. Float me. Advance so that I can catch up. Then I can fast forward. Then I can shiv. Then 44 damage crystal justice. Catch me. Shiv me. Boom. Shiv. Fork. Yeah, yeah. Incorpore blur blur. Okay. Advancing guard got upgraded. Smiley face. Proceeding. You feel something evil at your very core. You give 851 souls back to the heart. The heart squirms with elation. It sounds so sexual. Doesn't it? When the heart squirms with elation. I'm going to catch up all over it. Catch up, gang. Because it is. Oh, okay. <laughs> is that the whole thing? Is that the heart and I are having sex? I don't know. All right. Who do we want to kill first in this situation? I feel like I want to kill this guy because he has, he gets demon form off a lot of times and that's very scary. Let's advance. Get that hussy, heart pussy. Mm -hmm. And then we advance. And then we advance. I am a volcano. One in the chat of your kind of also a volcano. I get your core. Yeah, I just wanted to check. I don't have any mana left. Yikes. Not drawing any of my uh, radiant flames yet or my catch ups. I'm not liking this, but I do have an apparition in hand, so. Yeah, we definitely need to get rid of all Bewilders as soon as we find them. That is, like, imperative to everything that we are. It sucks that we have to take a damage to do so. <laughs> um. Yeah. <laughs> 
apparition me. Drawing the um, haunted is going to be a very scary turn for us. For sure. for a whole lot. Do I want to use my last apparition here? No, we have a campfire. And we have our seals. Mm. Die. Okay. This guy is like almost dead this turn. What happens when the gun guy dies? No more shooting. No more gun. Don't really want to use ketchup here. I'm definitely advancing guard next turn, I think, probably pretty well. Let's get rid of our slime. I hate that I have to take damage for this. Wait, I don't have to take damage for the second one? How does that make any sense? That makes no fucking sense. Um, hit me with one of these. Hit me with a nightmare thing for this. Okay, now we're advanced. Yep. Haunted's coming up right now. We're about to draw Haunted, and that's going to be annoying. Okay, so all my cards currently in hand are ethereal. Play that. Fast forward me. Catch me up. My apparition is ethereal? No! It's not my apparition! Hit him with one of these. Hit him with the ketchup. Hit him with a Kindle. I think we're just accidentally gonna kill this guy. This is a glorious day indeed. Hey, what up? I'm glorious for you. I'm feeling so glorious right now. Hey, this guy's dead. Oh, you're dead too. We all float down here, baby. Do nothing. One in the chat if you just kind of want to do nothing. Thank you, boy. Thank you for the 28, man. Dude, you've been killing it lately, homie. Happy for you. The second seal. <laughs> We could have had all six, actually. It's kind of funny. Gain a random ethereal card, it costs zero this turn. Gain a random power card, it costs zero until played. Time of need to get sixth seal. <laughs> Time of need uh, plus power potion, it gives us all the seals. Nah, because we didn't take fourth or third. Yeah, we don't have third. We have first, fourth, and fifth. We need the, we need the even numbers. <laughs> we need the even numbers. I think we're chilling though. I like I like this potion of gaining four block each time you play a card on my turn. So I'm gonna move on. Sacrifice. 
I think you can remove first seal right now, though. Thoughts? Study the spire. That's fun. You could also take another fast forward. Could also take an enlightenment. For our zero expensive cards. Alright. Thanks, babe. It's time. That is useless. I'm fighting one guy. One gal. One whale. Slam. Slam. Ignite. Advance. Fork. Fast forward. And turn. Radiate me. Haunt me. Kindle me. Shiv. Imagine if you had membership card. <laughs> yeah, did I have it sick? Haunted. Wait, ethereal unplayable when drawn at ethereal on our card. So it's, it doesn't matter if I play it or not. I can play it for three, though, if I want. I can also play Icky for three. Okay. I, I, I'm actually fine with most of this stuff getting exhausted. I mean, like, fourth seal does nothing. Crystal Shiv, like, it's not that. Like, these cards aren't that good. Like, this upgrade stuff, but, like, who the fuck cares? Also, this being ethereal, lol. <laughs> um... We'll play this. Okay. Might as well play this. I don't even need to actually. Hold on. Might as well slap you. <clears throat> Uh, bewildered, definitely want to get rid of that. Oh, volcano me. Okay, volcano's very good here. Shiv. I don't remember what those do. Aged. At the end of your turn, add a void to the top of your draw pile. Unplayable. It's so weird that that was unplayable, right? <laughs> Slap ya. How the fuck does Niao heal? Every time you play a card, Niao heals. Opposite of the heart, where the heart is every time you play a card, deal damage to you. It's kind of fun. It's kind of a cool, cool thing. Zoom two ethereal cards. No. Oh. Just get this out of hand. this out of hand, and then play this twice. Aged. At the end of your turn, add a void to your draw pile. Just played that, though. Alright, play you. Fast forward. Pog, I made it in time here. to watch the end, at least. Now we can catch up three times. Okay. One skill. If we play one skill, what do we bring back? Honestly, can just do this, though. And then you can advance. And then you can radiate and leave flame. Shiv him. Yep. K. 
Catch up. Shiv. Echo. Fast forward. Do nothing. Hit it with one of those. Icky. Wait, are you in divinity? Huh? Drink me. Dang. Shield me. No. Kindle me. Okay. Can get him with the shiv. Nightmare. Into. Incorporeal. Into nightmare vision. To bring back. Apparition. And seer. Apparition. Seer is going to play automatically. You fucking son of a bitch. You did it again. Fast forward first, I think. Fork. This goes off next turn, so I'm at No, he can't save this. Shit. Okay. We're getting there, man. Okay. Still has a theory. You gotta remember that. Uh, Definitely like the idea of floating here. No, I don't like the idea of floating. I think Forked Flame is probably better. First. Okay. And then catching up is actually pretty pog. Adds a bunch of uh, uh, of burn. And then we float. We float. We retract. So now we're back here. We shiv. We ignite. Double ignite. We fast forward. Potions, potions, potions. You know, I said you can backseat me today, but come on, man. You're, you're, you're not better than that, but be better than that. <clears throat> you gotta, you gotta have good backseating. Um, is it? All right, now I think we pop one of these. Ignite the Inferno Ghost Flame. That does nothing. Yeah, looks like we might just die this turn. It's tough. All right, let's burn these then. <laughs> Ignite the Infernal Ghost Flame. I think you have to play this and hope that they don't all cost three. I mean, we do have the energy potion now, though, so. Hey, look, they all cost three. It's weird. Because now we lose that, too, which does suck. And I think we're just dead anyways, though.
Boom! Damn! First character to lose with tough. Yeah, I wonder if I wonder how much this actually matters. The icy cream. I think that mattered. I think not drawing our volcano vis. No, I think we got volcano visage rather early. That was close though. It's because I skipped seals. True. 